Hi, I'm Mike Mahan with SMA America's Solar Academy. In the tech tip today, we're going to discuss how to add a standard user during the registration process of a WebConnect enabled inverter with the Sunny Portal. During step seven of the standard registration process for a WebConnect enabled inverter, there is an option to add an additional user to the Sunny Portal plant. This will allow a homeowner to have standard user level plant access. Once at step seven of the registration, Sunny Portal will ask for a little bit of basic system information based on your location. The kilowatt hours per kilowatt peak will vary. I'm entering a generic number for our system here. Enter the zip code for your location and city if you wish, the country, your time zone, and at the bottom you see approved system for sunny places and this is the important step for adding a standard user along with the administrator who is registering the plant. So for the homeowner you would enter their email address in this box here. Sunny Portal will send an invitation email to this address notifying the homeowner that they have user level access to their plant. We also need to click the automatic updates field. That will ensure that your communication device has the latest firmware version. And that's all there is. Step eight is simply a confirmation of all of the information that you have entered previously. If that is all correct, Click finish and you see that the information is being sent now to the Sunny Portal. If it is desired to add more users to the plant, under the configuration tab, any administrator level access person who logs into this plant will see a user management tab. Here we see that I registered the plant so I have been granted administrator level access and the homeowner was granted user level access. If there is a desire to add another user such as the installer who will be responsible for maintaining the system, simply click on new user, enter their email and grant them the appropriate access level and then click save. They will also receive an email from the Sunny Portal notifying them that they have been added to the plant. For installers and plant managers needing access to multiple systems on a frequent basis, the first step of the WebConnect registration can play a crucial role in easily managing systems from one account. During the first step, here you have the choice to register with Sunny Portal. If you are not currently registered, I am, so I will enter my Sunny Portal information. We always recommend that you use one generic email for your company to register all of your plants with the Sunny Portal. If you click on the PV system selection line at the top left, you see a drop down list of all plants that have been registered with the current email. So my email is associated with all of these plants. That is why we said during the registration step, it is very useful to have a company specific email such as SMA monitoring at mycompany.com register all WebConnect plants. They will then all show up in this single list and you can have access to all of them. If you'd like to learn more about the Sunny Boy TLUS with Secure Power Supply or WebConnect technology, please visit us at sma-america.com. My name is Mike Mahan from SMA America Solar Academy. Thanks for joining us.